whatever ideas you want about parallelograms you can post alaikum salam you can post pictures you can post ideas you go to google classroom write as many ideas or pictures or photos as you want on this google doc yalla what do you know about parallel one pair of parallel lines one pair of then non parallel no that's trapezoid but at least you are trying for number vertices Mr. all of the angles uh, is uh, parallel to each other angle will never be parallel to angle you mean side Yeah, side, side. Every not side all of, is uh, not all of them. Every two are parallel. Yeah, every two. Zero line of symmetry. Very great, Khalifa. B B over H is wrong. Please change it. Every two sides are. Change the word same. Can you write it parallel and congruent? Very good, Fahad. Uh, two pairs of parallel lines. Who wrote that? Ali. Plus one. Rectangles, rhombuses, and squares are parallelograms. Very good. A trapezoid has at least one pair of parallel sides. Very good. Who did that, Ahmed? Number of vertices, four. Number of edges, four. Very good. Pyrameter, two times the sum of length and adjacent sides. Very good. Now put me put pictures, please. Can you post pictures? Every two sides are parallel and congruent. Total of 360 degrees. Oh my God, Fahad. I'm giving grades, huh? Yalla, I need photos about parallelogram. Okay, I will give you a hint. Somebody said the total of the angles is 360. Why? Because it's a quadrilateral. It has four sides. So four minus two is two times 180, 360. Good job. Every two angles are, every two opposite angles are. Congruent. So every two opposite angles are congruent. Please write that. And you, there is something. There are two angles that are acute and two angles that are obtuse. Post a photo and you will help the class. If you post a photo, you will Oh my God, who put this photo? Okay, now let's let's look at this photo. If you see my screen. What do we call the number 12 here? Base. Very great. And the number six? Height. Height. The number eight? Sight. Adjacent side. يعني جارو. يا بطل. What is the answer? I answered it. تحتيها. What I is answered the area? The area. So somebody okay, said okay. every two sides are parallel and congruent. That's absolutely correct. And who can change it? Every two sides, any two sides or opposite? No, opposite. It must be opposite. Every two opposite sides are are parallel, not the parallel. Are parallel and congruent. That means that means look at this side. Look at my screen. This side up and this side down are parallel, and they have the same length. So parallel and congruent. And these two sides opposite of each other on the right and the left also parallel and congruent. Now the next one, the total angles is 360, total of 360 degrees. So here we change it. The sum of all angles has a total of 360 degrees. This is the way how you write math. Good job. Now, rectangles, rhombus, rhombi. Rhombus is single. Rhombi is plural rectangles run by uh, run by and squares are parallelograms yes all of them are parallelograms because every two opposite sides are parallel so who knows why we called it parallelogram why did we call it parallelogram what does it, it mean is, uh, it same, parallel. Uh, parallel same base same height parallel what's the meaning of parallel two lines are the same are parallel they see each other parallel yani they have the same direction not necessary to have the same <coughs> Opposite angles are equal. Who wrote this one? It's amazing. I like Now, so, I want you to... Uh, congruent. Congruent. Change it to congruent. Because in geometry, we don't say uh, 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 the same. The same we say in algebra. In geometry, we say congruent. So here, congruent. Different color. Good job. Opposite sides are equal and parallel. Good job. But instead of equal, I should write Ahmed Al-Qamash. Good job. Change the color if you like. Diagonals bisect each other. Wow, wow, wow. Who wrote this one? I wanted to explain it to us, please. Okay, I will help you. I will go to insert drawing, huh? <coughs> and I will draw for you a parallelogram. Draw the diagonals. Diagonals are the lines that match between two opposite angles. So this is the first diagonal, and this is the second diagonal. So we call them diagonals. Now, he said, your friend said, diagonals bisect each other. What's the meaning of bisect? That means they intersect each other at the middle, at the midpoint. Yani that means this line segment is congruent to this line segment. And this line segment is congruent to this line segment. Yani let's see. 
if this is nine inch, this will be nine inch. If this is 12 inches, this will be 12 inch. And we call this point midpoint, this one. So this is the meaning of every diagonals, two diagonals. We cannot say every because there are only two. The diagonals bisect each other. Yani they cut or intersect each other at the middle. So let's say that because there are only two diagonals. The diagonals bisect each other. Now, next one. Oh, who did this? Who colored this? I think Ahmad Al Gamash, right? Very great, Ahmad. The sum, he means the, the sum of, the sum of any two adjacent angles is 180. Any two next to each other, the sum of them is 180. Can you give us an example and you get five from the beginning of the day? Any two adjacent angles, the sum is 180. I'll go to insert drawing and choose parallelogram. We. I don't like this color. I will color it with this color. Let's see. Now, I need two adjacent angles. Let's say this angle, 70 degrees. I'll change the color of writing to white. So this angle is 70 degrees. What do you think this angle is? No. 90, Mr. No. What angle, Mr. He said every two adjacent angles are 180. So these these two angles are adjacent because next to each other. One of them is 70. What is the other one? The other one is uh, uh, 8, 9, Both, both of 90. them, Ahmed, you wrote that. You wrote, you wrote that the sum of them is 180. You wrote that. Okay, Mr. 70 degrees and 70 degrees is not uh, 180. I wanted to find the other one. If one of them is 70, what is the other one? It's not right. 180 minus 70. No, I do calculate one, eight, one eight. No need. 70 is 180. Very good. So he said every two next to each other, every two <coughs> adjacent angle. <coughs> that means this angle, because it's the neighbor of the 70 adjacent, they must be 180. Who knows this angle, the, the last one? This angle here. 70. Very good. Either you say it's 70 because it's adjacent to the 110s, or you say it's 70 because it's opposite of the 70. So here, these two angles, guys, are what? These two angles are congruent. Yani every two opposite angles are congruent because they are opposite each other. But the two angles that are next to each other, they are what? Parallel. We cannot say parallel to angle. Every two angles. Every two angles that are opposite each other, what do we uh, uh, congruent? But next to each other, adjacent. Shubikunu. <laughs> they add up to 180. Yani supplementary. Yani shape. Next to each other. Yani they, yani the, the sum of them is 180. Yani supplementary. Every two adjacent angles are supplementary. Every two, every two adjacent. Adjacent means jiran. Yani 70 and 110. They are supplementary. Yani they add up to 180. But every two opposite angles are congruent. And every two opposite angles are congruent. That, that means they have the same measurement. Every two opposite angles are congruent. Yani 70 and 70. Every two angles next to each other, we call them adjacent. They add up to 180. This is very important. It can come as multiple choice. Any question about that? Okay, great. Still now. Ali 3, Khalifa 2. Abdullah. Fahd Al-Hajri 2. Swedi 1. Tamash 2. Abdullah 1. If you want to end the day with this grade, Congratulations. If you want more, stay with me. Two pairs of parallel lines. Who wrote that? It's a very great idea. He said every two opposite lines are parallel. He means like that. Every two opposite lines are parallel. This is the meaning of it. Mr. There is also parallel. And what is the opposite of parallel? Perpendicular or what? It's not opposite, brother. It's like they are not having the same direction. They are intersecting each other. So opposite of parallel is intersecting. But if the angle between them is 90 degrees, we call them perpendicular. Now the area, he said base times height. Very great, Ali. And he said area equals base times height. I will give you the base, I will give you the height, and you will calculate the area. It has four vertices, yani it has four angles. Good job. Zero line of symmetry. Imagine the 
parallelogram. Can you cut it or split it into two equal? Now, somebody said base times height, good job, yeah, Ahmed. Parameter is the sum of all the sides. And he said, very great idea, this one. The number of vertices are four. Actually, vertex is single. Plural, vertices. We don't say vertexes. Number of edges is four. Rectangles, rhomboses, rhombi, and squares are parallelograms. A trapezoid has at least, me katab at least, galat, has only, has only one pair of parallelograms, not, not more, more than so. that. Only one pair. Parallelogram is the mother. The sons are rhombus and rectangle. Yani. And that, that is cool. If all the sides are congruent in a parallelogram, we can call it rhombus, which is diamond. Bilbatta is more diamond. If the angles are 90, huh, because it's more rectangle. Now, if a rectangle and a rhombus become one shape, يعني union, اتحدوا, or are so united, it will be so square. It, square. يعني, it will take the right angles from the rectangle, من, من Abu. And it will take the congruent sides من أمه من الرومبوس يعني إذا تزوج الركتانجل مع الرومبوس بيجيبه سكوير هيك قصدي بصراحة يعني Squares have all sides congruent They got it from rhombus And they have right angles They got it from rectangle But the, the grandfather of all of them is parallelogram I think now you understand this more I have already explained this huh. See? They said vertical line of symmetry. It doesn't work. Horizontal line of symmetry. It doesn't work. Ahmed is a very smart and brilliant student. He said, what if we cut it with the scissor? They will be, they will be uh, Khalifa. They will be on each other. But no, I, ah, Saud, walak nasiyanak ani. So if you reflect it, okay. La, shuf, so if you kasi. cut it, you have to. If you cut it, you have to pull it down. Yes, I'm when not doing that down. in line of symmetry, Ali. I'm bending it. If I bend it, it will not be the same. يعني ما بينطبقوا على بعض. عارف شو قصدي? Diagonal lines of symmetry doesn't work. This doesn't work. Try it on a piece of paper. It doesn't work. Actually, there is only one line of symmetry. It doesn't have lines of symmetry. Now, the area Ali said base times height. 12 times 6 is 72. What did he forget? Huh? What did he forget? Area. 72 what? Square centimeter. <تصفيق> competition the whole class till now Saud plus two Abdullah Imadi one Muhammad Gamash plus three